few weeks back I have uploaded one video how to fix selenium launch issue so there was one update from chrome that the moment you start working with chrome 111 we were getting a lot of issues from selenium side and we discussed a quick fix in this video that how you can fix a particular issue and today I also got one comment that I am facing the same issue with edge browser so I thought I will quickly record a video on this that what exactly you need to do in order to fix this issue so the previous version we added one argument so if you're working with chrome 111 and if you're using the older versions then you have to add this particular argument in order to continue but with the recent release of selenium now you don't need to add this you can continue without adding any chrome options have done my name is mukesh otwani from learnhyperinnovation.com so in this video i will give you a quick fix and i will show you what exactly changed in selenium repository so for this let me go back and just go ahead search for selenium and just go to their official website and go to downloads now if you see the recent version that we are going to discuss today is 4.8.3 and if you go to the change log the change log clearly mentioned that what exactly happened in 4.8.2 so in 4.8.2 they have automatically added this particular argument which is remote allow origins that we have added manually right now with the latest version you don't need to add separately automatically it will take care so let me show you right now at this moment i am using 4.8.1 and if i go back and if i just uncomment this okay or maybe this chrome option is added but i have not added here let me run this particular piece of code and let me show you what exception you will be getting so if you just open the console it will launch the session because the browser will start but the moment you see the uh, url it will open it will throw you one exception so it will launch the browser but it will end up throwing connection failed exception that was the issue earlier right and how did we fix it we created chrome options and we added opt here now if you are completely new to this particular solution i would highly recommend you to watch this video which is selenium fix provided in this video i have given the detailed uh, you know issue what exactly happened and how did we fix it now in this video i will make a small change and this issue will be fixed so what you need to do in the latest uh, version this issue has been fixed so either you can continue with 4.8.2 or you can continue with 4.8.3 since this is the latest version you can continue with this so what i will do in this one i will not do anything i will remove everything and i will remove even opt so we what we will do we'll just write web driver driver equal to new chrome driver and since selenium maintains now browsers automatically sorry drivers automatically no need to give web driver manager and in which cases you need the drivers that also I explained in my previous video so i would highly recommend if you spend some 5 minutes you will get some more information about the drivers at this moment i updated to 4.8.3 and if i try to run this it will work without any issue not only with chrome even if you try for edge browser or even firefox it will work without any issue so let's see i just started a session google it will get the title and it will quit okay so once the page will load then only it will move to the next statement yeah we got it in the same way even if i go for edge driver i have edge already installed on my system so if i try for edge driver also it will work it will open a edge browser continue as it is okay so quick fix now no need to add manually update to 4.8.2 or 4.8.3 so let me know if you face any other issue okay we can discuss that in the next video now this is my observation on my system mac when i start the edge first time it takes time so you can see it is taking a lot of time to launch the browser but once the browser will start next time it will build real faster so let's wait let's wait for edge browser to come up 
okay now you can see it's starting edge microsoft edge web driver was started successfully and yes it's running without any issue it will launch the google and once it will load then it will exit same thing you can do for firefox so try for firefox edge chrome let me know if you face any issue and we can discuss that in the next video so in case if your friends colleagues are struggling with this exception please share this video with them and if you like this video then do comment like this video subscribe this channel and i will see you in the next video till then bye bye take care